Open blinds. Good morning, Adam. You have one new message. From? David Sarin. <sighs> Play it. Adam, it's David. I know it's been a while, but after what happened in Prague yesterday... Look, son, whatever reasons you have for not getting in touch these last two years, life's too short. I'm leaving for London soon, but uh, give me a call. You saved his vid call number? Yes, Adam. Just activate your TV system. As you wish. I'll keep you safe. As you wish. But remember, homeowner, this poses a substantial security risk. It's Jensen. It's good to finally hear from you, Agent. You doing okay? Sorry about the downtime. I'll get to the office as soon as I can, but my augs took a hit during the attack. I need to get them looked at. Of course. There's a lot of work... Get ...ahead of us, Jensen. I've I'll see you when you get in. Dr. Kohler, I need to pay you a visit. Jensen! Now's actually a really good time for me, like right now! Something wrong? There are some guys in my bookshop. Pissed off the valley gangster looking guys. So, unless you want bloodshed the day after a terror attack... The front door isn't the most peaceful option. I got it. I never should have signed a three-year lease on my apartment.
Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Anyone can be guilty by association. prices in Prague. Not talking hot dogs here. If the hot dogs aren't your main business, why don't you have a store? See, this way, I get to keep my overhead down and pass on the savings to the customers. Entrepreneurial. Better believe it. What have you got? Well, I got info. The kind that's worth something. Could always use reliable intel. Who couldn't? But for that, I only accept payment in your opposite. I don't have any. Sorry, it's a deal breaker. But find me again if you get any, okay? If you're not shopping, you don't need to stick around. Here we go. Oh, look at these. You look like one of those singularity church crazy. Getting past the human trash on the streets. Come on, that. Sorry. Actually, I'm pretty sure he's everything. Interesting, look. Street is off limits, Oyobok. Private function. All businesses are temporarily closed. This district. There is all wrong. You! Stop right there! Yeah, you! Down on your knees! Hands behind your head. Like this? Yes, I'm going to frisk you now. Don't move. I need some luck. If I were them, that's for me to find out. I said your Hello, papers sir. are expired.
Trace program initiated. Access granted. Forget about Doc Larry, Doc Larry. Show me latest papers. Otherwise, you cannot go through here. I know the drill. The drill has changed. Too many forgeries. All OGs must now carry a supplementary permit authentication card. Do you have this card? Clear it up with the people I work for. They'll take care of it. And who do you work for exactly? Does it matter? You worried I might outrank you? <laughs> of course not. These rules, they apply to everyone. Besides, I am regional director of, uh, of uh, document checking. I report to God directly. It is God who tells me that if you continue this way, without proper permit, I am morally obliged to shoot you. Is that right? My friend, I know what you're thinking. It's terrible the way they make laws against your kind. But listen, maybe I can do something to help. We could come to an understanding. What kind of understanding? Lucky for you, I know a guy. An expert in... Uh, permitification. A document agent. He offers permits, authentication cards. Peace of mind. With his help, you go wherever you want, whenever you want. No more hassles. What do you say? Seems to me like you're taking advantage of Ogs, preying on their paranoia. I am in the business of selling hope. A chance to walk free. To stay out of Gollum. Otherwise, you risk trouble with the law. Not fun for a foreign og like you. Maybe they send you home. Maybe somewhere worse. Why do I get the feeling you're trying to sell me a car that doesn't work? I'm not selling anything. I'm saying, go look at the car. You need these people on your side. Otherwise, you live in constant fear, threat of deportation. Besides, you really want to risk taking on an entire police force here in the middle of a crowded city. After you funnel Augs to this friend of yours, what happens next? You get them to buy some scrap of plastic they probably don't even need, gouge them for all they're worth? The permits they get in return, they are very good. Don't underestimate what that can mean to people. You should really go see this friend of mine. This document agent you mentioned, you see the one in charge? He gets you to stop Augs and offer them this opportunity to do business with him. Go see for yourself. My friend has documents to pass checkpoints, to keep police off your back, to get into parts of Prague you never knew existed. Tell him Drahumir sent you. You'll see. 
I give you address, yes? All right, give me the address. I think I'd like to see who's behind all this. Shekashka. There's a courtyard behind the apartment building. Very easy to find. My friend will be there. He will get you latest permit card. Just pay him and don't ask questions. I think we need to grow. This area is restricted to you, Og. Your kind is not told. You're looking for. I was stopped by someone named Drahomir at a checkpoint. He sent me here. Apparently you help Ogs with documentation, upgrade their permits. You have the money. Maybe. You want to tell me what I'm paying for exactly? You pay to get your name on the list. Melina upstairs, she works on your shiny new permit. You come back in one week to pick it up. Standard pickup fee will apply. How much do you charge people for this? Not people. Augs. 35,000 credits. You're not even trying, are you? You just blatantly scam Augs out of as much as you can. You want updated permit or not? Documents are actually pretty good. You'll see. Trust me. The girl is very talented. These documents, what are they? Stolen? Forged? Invisible? Look, just give me what you have, and I'll put your name on the list. That's how it works. Melina does surprisingly good work, puts more effort in than we ask her to. This is as much as I'm willing to give you. So what kind of shiny new permit does this get me? Fucking tourist. You're wasting my time, Og. Mir would let us set up a second. You think after Rosika, business would be up? There's a bad vibe on the streets. Ah! Ah! Oh, oh, hey. You got me! Good. <laughs> Money is slow to a trickle. You looking for permit? Someone's here. Check it out.
Your death draws near! Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. If you guys want me... Please, don't shoot me! You wanna tell me what's going on here? Arts and crafts? I think you work for those scam artists out there. Or do they work for you? It was never meant to be a scam. More like uh, social services for the disaffected. You know, like no og left behind. Looks like a forgery ring to me. Hate the word forgery. I prefer graphic arts activism. I, I help people to, to to be other people. And seriously, try getting anywhere with forgery on your resume. You're involved in something that takes advantage of people, and you're worried about your resume. That that may have come out wrong. I mean, yes, career is important, but it's not everything. I know that. I t I tend to get really nervous when I'm stressed. I I mean, I, I'm stressed when, which always just makes things worse. Okay, look, I have no reason to be nervous here, do I? Y you're totally on my side, right? One of the good guys, not like Dragomir. I'm not here to make you nervous. I just need you to explain it to me. The essentials of what's been going on here. <sighs> essentials, right. Essentially, I was trying to help my augmented friends. The way I saw it out there, the promise of fake documents was being used to extort people. How does that help them? The extortion part sucks. I swear to you, I'm totally anti-extortion. Obviously. Let me explain better. As the government, they print up these official permits each month. But they only sell them to the rich corporate and military allies. Meanwhile, the other Orgs, they get kettled out of the city because their documents aren't up to date enough. That's what was happening to my friends. Government corruption versus organized crime. And regular people get caught in the middle. You gotta love the classics. When it was just me, I didn't charge anyone. But then Drahomir shows up and turns it into this big operation with fake checkpoints and ridiculous fees. I didn't want anything to do with that. I wanted to stop. Why didn't you? I was scared. 
Drahomir said he would kill me. Looked at me kind of... Like you're looking at me now. You're not going to kill me, are you? What do you think? I'm not sure yet. Look, the real problem is Drahomir and that checkpoint of his. Without him in the picture, the rest of them couldn't run a lemonade stand. Maybe you could... You know... You think I just walk around shooting people? Don't you? I like knowing there are other options. Okay, so stab him, scare him, or get the police to do their job for once. I remember Drahomir mentioning this cop who threatened him. She was hanging around his checkpoint. Who knows? Maybe there really is one good cop in Prague. That sounds like the safest bet. Otherwise, you're asking me to pick a fight with a bunch of guys in uniforms, scam artists or not. The whole city would come down on you. Still, up to you how you want to handle it. Right. And just so we're clear, you are going to stop forging documents now. I don't like getting into trouble. And even worse is other people suffering because of me. No more faking documents ever again. Unless someone really, really needed one, then I'd probably do it. I mean, if we knew for a fact that we could help someone, we should do whatever we can, right? It depends what you have in mind. The docs I make, they really can fool the authorities. Sort of. Sort of? Drachomir flooded the streets with forgeries, so the city started tracking more, adding scanners, validation numbers. Now, unless one of my permits gets activated in the city database, it's just plastic. So you're telling me these people pay for forgeries and then probably get deported anyway? It doesn't have to be that way. I have two permits that I literally just made. And I think we can really help these people. If you're willing. All right, how do we help? Their names are Edward Broad and Irenka Bauer. Drachomir was going to charge them like 20 more times. But maybe you could just give them the forgeries? Early Christmas present? You said it's just plastic that people get deported anyway. How does this help them? I think I know how to get them activated. As long as you're willing to follow through. All right. I'll go meet Edward and Irenka. In the meantime, are you going to be okay here? Once they learn that Drahomir has been taken care of, the others will leave me alone. He's the one I'm scared of. By the way, there is a safe over there where they keep their money. I'll give you the code. 2489. Feel free to help yourself. What about you? Way ahead of you. I'm always here.